Well, over the summer, Harry Potter author J.K. Rowling was widely criticized for comments that were perceived as transphobic. With more on this is Pete Davidson. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Colin. Thank you so much. Uh, I just learned it's Mental Illness Awareness Week, so I wanted to make everyone aware. We out here, and we crazy. Go Giants! <laughs> <laughs> Season starts tomorrow. Yes, this is the Giants tomorrow. year. Everyone says it. So what do you think about this J.K. Rowling controversy? Uh, I think I'm never getting another tattoo for the rest of my life. Uh, don't get tattoos. I got a Harry Potter tattoo years ago because I'm not psychic. I didn't know J.K. Rowling was going to go all Mel Gibson on us. <laughs> I have a Game of Thrones tattoo. Now I'm terrified one day George R.R. R. Martin's just going to be like, hey, if you enjoy what I had to say about dragons and direwolves, wait till you hear what I think about Puerto Ricans. <laughs> I also have a Winnie the Pooh tattoo. Am I going to have to find out he was diddling Piglet the whole time? This is madness. <laughs> it's crazy times we live in. It's not fair. Now, how did you uh, feel when you first heard that Rowling said something transphobic? Uh, it really hurt, you know, because I have a close connection to those movies. I even look like Dobby the house elf if he became a TikTok rapper. <laughs> that wasn't very nice. <laughs> it is scarily accurate. But the only difference between me and Dobby is I'm a real person and his movies get released in theaters. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, oh, yeah. uh -huh. All right, so you found, you found what J.K. Rowling said disappointing. Very disappointing, yeah. I longed for a few years ago when the worst thing she ever did were those Fantastic Beasts movies, you know? No discrimination there. Those films harmed us all equally. I mean, what's wrong with her, Colin? She creates a seven-book fantasy series about all types of mythical creatures living in harmony with wizards and elves, and the one thing she can't wrap her head around is Laverne Cox? <laughs> She's a national treasure. Yeah. Did, did, you, did you find what J.K. said surprising then? Yeah, at first. But then I started thinking about the fantastical world she created. The woods are controlled by centaurs. The schools are run by wizards and ghosts. But who controls the banks? Jews, obviously. <laughs> Little giant nose Jew goblins. <laughs> and I could say that because, as you can see, I'm half goblin. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on, if this isn't a Jews run the banks reference, why do they all look exactly like Alan Dershowitz? <laughs> the Dersh! You can Dersh, Dersh! <laughs> all right. So, Pete. I'm having so, fun. Yeah, no, I'm having fun tonight. <laughs> so, Pete, will you stop reading the books? I never read any of the books, and I saw a part of Azkaban on a plane once. Pete Davidson, everyone. Hey, vote for Biden! Can we get an update on College Joe? Michael Chase at night!